23rd of February and it is my 25th birthday and the sun is about to come over this hill. It's so beautiful today. Look at the water, look at the seagulls, look at the waves, look at the sand, look at the people enjoying their morning, including me, and look at the sun. It's just like swelling over that hill. And I've made myself a cup of chai. Where are we? Here we are. Birthdays are so funny because it's just another date, but it's the day you were born. And I don't know, it feels like there's, there can be like so much kind of expectation sometimes on your birthday. And like you have to do this and hang out with people and have a whole thing. And I don't know, I feel like it can be stressful sometimes having a birthday, even though it shouldn't be. Like that's not the idea of a birthday. So my plan for today, for my birthday, is I want to chill and I want to just like have some me time. I feel like I've been quite social lately and quite busy with work. And so I just want to take today to do things that I enjoy um, just for the present moment, like not things that like need an outcome, if that makes sense, because I feel like that's what I've been doing with work. First part of the day is sunrise. I'm so glad I came down to watch it because it's so beautiful. I also feel like there's something nice about watching the sunrise on your birthday. Like this is it's your sun today, do you know what I mean? And it's such a beautiful day, it's so clear. I'm definitely gonna go for a swim in a second. But yeah, I just wanna go out to a cafe, write in my journal, read my book, go to the bookstore, maybe buy a new book, go to the record store, maybe buy a new record, get myself some presents and just enjoy the day. And then I'm having dinner with Joy tonight. So all round a very very pleasurable enjoyable day and i'm really really looking forward to it and the sun feels so nice on my face right now and i've got my chai here although these travel cups keep it hot for so long and so it like never cools down i'm like blowing on it like waiting for it to cool down and it's just like perpetually boiling hot it's all right. i want to just write in my journal and reflect a bit and reflect on the year I've just had I feel like it's been a huge year of growth and self-discovery and healing which has been really really amazing to experience and also kind of tiring in the best way possible just like I feel like I've been learning a lot and expanding evolving and I'm so grateful for all the people that have like contributed to that because I do think that so much of our self growth and development and healing and all of that comes from our connections with people and the things we experience when we're like in the presence of somebody else when we're connected to that person and I feel like I've had a lot of those really meaningful connections this year and I'm so 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 grateful for every single one of them of course now I'm cheering up on the morning of my birthday absolute tradition <laughs> but yeah I'm just so grateful i'm just so grateful for like yeah the way that life unfolds it's so beautiful and there have been painful moments and pleasurable moments in the past year but they've all been like a part of the same thing and like a part of the evolution um and i feel like i'm in a place like if i think about myself right now compared to myself on my birthday last year I feel like this past year has made me so much more accepting of life and of like everything that comes with life. Like I feel like I'm not fighting things as much anymore and like trying to control things and trying to make things a certain way. I feel like that had caused me so much anxiety in the past. I think just surrender and accepting is the word. And I think that that's something my connections with people have taught me so much this year. I'm so proud of myself. I'm so proud of myself for the past year. But yeah, I just want to feel the sun on my face and go for a swim and soak up this beautiful day. It's going to be hot today. It's going to be 34 degrees. I'm also house sitting for the weekend, which is really nice. So I'm going to have my own space. And yeah, I just want to have a very calm, introspective time. So that is exactly what we're going to do.
to these presents my mum left on my bed. I'm gonna have a shower and then open these. Empty bottles. I feel like there's more to this. to make kombucha and the glass bottles are to make the kombucha in. It all makes sense. on her birthday. <laughs> so beautifully wrapped.
We're getting dinner. We're getting dinner with your Cami. The birthday I'm girl. Dress. Yeah, I've never, so, like, <laughs> never seen you in something like this. I know, I feel like a new woman. I can't wait to give you your um, present. What's I good? Have a present. You have a present. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. What it's it's so broken. <laughs> it's it's, it's like a cam camera water. at this point. It's, it's like, yeah, I can't, literally, you can't you'll only find out after you get, 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 get it. Get it back here yeah. <laughs> on, the, on the laptop. Literally. Chaos already. Um, Absolute chaos. I'm Hopefully, enjoy what I did today. Um, oh yeah, she ran me and through. And then I came home, and then uh, what did I do when I went home? I think I was just like doing bits and bobs, and I was opening my presents. From my oh, my mum got me the cutest presents. Really? She wrote me a really nice card, and I cried. Oh, <laughs> what did she get you? Um, kombucha scoby and glass jars and a record. <laughs> she gets really me. Thank you. Okay, hold on. We are about yeah. to enter. Okay. okay. Oh, okay. Darling. 